just a quick video on uh, my jury rigged throttle position sensor uh, I don't even know what you want to call it wiring harness I guess um, so I made this I made one of these a couple years ago but I uh, lost it so I'm making this other one I gotta test this thing out I got this engine is running three gallons per hour less efficient than the other one so I'm gonna test that out so anyway what I did is I just uh, spliced together some wires this is the throttle position sensor wire it's tucked in behind the oil um, it's got a pink a red and a um, orange the orange and the pink are the ones that end up getting tested together for the voltage so what I did is I stripped down some number 18 solid wire and uh, they fit nicely into this female side and on the other side which is the male um, I just used some number I guess they're 14 uh, gauge, um, cr you know, uh, whatever they guess they're, you know, uh, crimps and, um, you know, the waterproof uh, shrink type. And so basically, it's basically a through to through right now. And then I've got these um, splices on the ends here, and I'll just use these for, um, you know, putting the meter probes into to test the voltage. So. That's it. Instead of buying the product to do it, it's a pretty simple way of doing it. And um, maybe somebody gets something out of it. But um, don't pay attention to my colors here. I've matched my colors to the ass end side on both of them to make sure that I'm, on, I'm connected properly. Um, and I've actually also labeled them so that I know that red I'm not supposed to use. My green wire is actually my pink wire. And um, my yellow wire is actually my orange wire. So basically, I'm not going to use the red when I do it. I'm just going to test the probes against these two here. And I'm going to be looking for 50 volts plus or minus 2 volts. There you go.